Brynjolf's been looking for you about the Guildmaster ceremony. Brynjolf told me he was looking for you about the Guildmaster ceremony. Guildmaster, huh? Well, guess we could do worse. Better go see Brynjolf about it. I heard Brynjolf wants to see you about being Guildmaster. I suppose my turn will come one day. But for now, you'll do nicely. Brynjolf tells me you'll make an excellent Guildmaster. Oh, he's looking for you, by the way. So, you're finally going to make Guildmaster, eh? Well, you better track down Brynjolf to seal the deal. Brynjolf's looking for you. Something about becoming the Guildmaster. So, they're making you leader, huh? Better go find Brynjolf so we can seal the deal. Did you know Brynjolf was looking for you? I think it's about the Guildmaster ceremony. I think it's time we make this Guildmaster thing official. Go and talk to Brynjolf. He's making preparations. I heard Brynjolf is looking for you. I think it's time for the Guild to have a new leader. Well, my friend, the time's come to make it official. It's time to become our guild master. Don't worry. I promise this will be short and sweet. If you'll just meet us in the center of the cistern room, we can begin. We can talk after the guild master ceremony. I've never been good at these things, so I'm just gonna keep it short. Being Guildmaster means more than just getting a cut of all the loot. It's about being a leader, and keeping this rabble in order. With that in mind, I propose that the position of Guildmaster should be yours. Delvin? Agreed. Vex? Sure, why not? Carlia? Absolutely. Everyone is in agreement. So all I can do now is name you Guildmaster. I wish you good fortune and long life. Now everyone, get back to work. I suppose you deserve it. Couldn't do any worse than Mercer anyway. So there the pupil is the master, eh? Good shot. I There's suppose plenty more congratulations are in order. Now don't screw it up. You need anything, anything at all. Don't hesitate to ask. Take a good look around you. Have you ever seen the guild in such a prosperous state? With Mercer Fregar and our influence spreading across Skyrim, the guild's earned a new level of respect it hasn't seen in decades. I couldn't be more proud to be part of the Thieves' Guild, or its new guild master. Well, that's it. Sorry if it isn't the ceremony you were hoping for, but we're not exactly known for throwing our coin around. After we're done, Head over to Tenelia, and she'll set you up with your Guildmaster armor. Oh, and one last thing. Here, I want you to take this. It's sort of a tradition around here. Well, looks like you're running the show now. Good luck. Glad to see they picked the right person for the job. I suppose congratulations are in order. Now don't screw it up. We're all rich thanks to you. Cheers. I am at your service. Congratulations, boss. I can't think of a better person for the job, Nightingale. I'm feeling a sense of inner peace.
something I haven't felt in a very long time. Instead of being clouded with thoughts of revenge and retribution, I feel only serenity and fulfillment. Of course, I've been also dabbling in my old pastimes as well. Take a look around, and feel free to share the fruits of my labor. I think by now, most within the Guild are well aware of what transpired between Mercer Frey and ourselves. The notion that the Nightingales are a fictive group has long since passed. If you wish to wear your Nightingale armor within the Guild, I'm certain that no one would give it a second thought. It was good speaking with you again. Glad to see they picked the right person for the job. I promise to live up to your expectations. As long as you continue to make us all rich, I'm behind you. I think everyone's waiting for the ceremony to get going. Before I suppose you deserve it. Something. Couldn't do any worse than Mercer, anyway. These jobs aren't going to finish themselves, you know. Who will be? So now the pupil is the boss, eh? Oh, Good shot. I, may just I hear Edmund's quite pleased to have his merchandise back. He's a powerful ally in Markov. Should help the Guild regain a foothold in the West. The Guild's at full strength, and we have you to thank for it. We've had our share of dark times, and now they seem like a distant memory. I'm going to tell you something. You'll never hear me say again, but if you tell anyone I told you, I'll deny it. When you walk through the guild, don't be ashamed to hold your head high, because you're the best damn thief in the place. What's the matter? Afraid of getting your hands dirty? So, you're Brynjolf's new protege, eh? Don't look like much to me. I haven't seen so much celebrating in years. Mercer's dead. We have a new guildmaster. And things are finally looking up. Business is booming, coin is flowing, and everyone seems content. As things keep going our way, a new chapter in the Thieves' Guild is being written this day. And we all owe it to you. Many thanks. Until next time. Before we get down to business, I've got something I need you to do. Well, as you know, the guild's growing and things are looking up around here. The only thing we're lacking is a reliable way to transport our merchandise across Skyrim. I'm not sure if you've noticed, but there are several Khajiit caravans that travel across the realm. They're shrewd traders and don't mind getting their hands dirty. I've bartered with their leader, Rasad, on more than one occasion. Actually, I want you to bring him something. You see, the caravans are notorious for transporting illegal substances. Present Rasad with this satchel of moon sugar, and I bet my last septum he'll make a deal. Rasad is the head of a small syndicate of independent merchant families. Each caravan is obliged to pay dues, but in return, a small portion of the profits are shared between them and the leader parcels out the routes. If we could make contact with them, they could provide an excellent way to inconspicuously transport goods for us. It's an illegal substance highly favored by the Khajiit. Very difficult to come by. If moon sugar is refined properly, it can be used to make skooma, another substance that will knock you over after a single draft. Yes, and I'm more than happy to give it to you. I mean, look at this place. I've never seen so much wealth down here. You've made us all rich. Here you go. Should fit you like a glove, boss. I've got coin and I've got merchandise. Let's see what we can do. You'll find Rasad with his caravan group. Just don't do anything stupid when you get there.
You approach as if you know us, stranger. Who are you, and what do you want? Yes, I've heard the guild is rising back to power. An alliance would be most beneficial to both parties. I will consider the offer, but I'll have to discuss it with the other caravans. Ah, moon sugar. I could smell it on you. I am pleased with this offer, and accept. Take my word to the leaders of your guild, and tell them we look forward to a prosperous and profitable future. If you happen upon any of our caravans in your travels, we'd also be more than willing to pay you a fair sum for any of your stolen goods. Give my regards to Tomilia. Tell her I'll contact her soon. Welcome to the cozy little family. I'm one of the lookouts for the guild. I watch Delvin's back. Yeah, good. I'll contact some of my people and have them prepare some shipments right away. Good job. Here, let me give you something for all the legwork. Now, if you'll excuse me. <laughs> 